Hi everyone! Welcome to FIC Up. We're very glad that you are here. Our service is about to start soon, but before we proceed, we have some few announcements. These are the activities that we do here in our church. First, we have the Wednesday prayer meeting. It's every 6.30 p.m. every Wednesday at the back of the church. So here we encourage one another, pray for one another, and study the Word of God so that we can help each other to grow in Christ more. Next, we have the House Church Bible Study. This is the God's Grace Christian Fellowship. This is 11.30 a.m. every other Friday on the address on the screen. Next, we have the Youth Bible Study. This is for ages 10 to 18 years old. This is every 6 p.m. every Friday here at the main church building in our sanctuary. Here, we encourage the young generation so that they can grow more in their relationship with God. This is another of Bible study dedicated for the young generation. Next, we have the young adult Bible study. This is for ages 18 years old and above. This is dedicated for young adults and young professionals. This is 8.30 p.m. every Friday also here at the main church building in our sanctuary. Here is another Bible study that is more specific for the young adults and they, here we encourage one another again to grow more in Christ. Next one, we have the men and women's breakfast. This is every 9 a.m. every first Saturday of every month. Also here at the main church building in our sanctuary. Here, we provide food, of course, for everyone because it's breakfast. And um, we also provide spiritual food for one another so that the um, married ones can grow in Christ. Next, we have the youth prayer and worship night. This is every 6 p.m. every first Friday of every month. This is also done here in our main church building in our sanctuary. Here, we focus on prayer and worship more. So if you enjoy the service later on, you can come to this every first Friday of every month so that we can worship and pray more for the nation. Next, we have the Family Count. This is going to be happening on Cam Woodward Lake Bay, Washington. And it's going to be on August 11 to 13. That's Thursday to Saturday. So right now, we're actually open for signing up. So if you want to sign up and for more details, please contact Pastor James Necron for more information. <laughs> Next, we have the Youth Summer Camp. This is gonna be happening on Black Diamond Camp on Auburn, Washington. It's gonna be on August 24 to 27. That's Wednesday to Saturday. So we're actually also open for sign up for this one. So if you are a youth or young adults or young professional, please reach out to me so that I can give you more information and sign you up. Next, ministry opportunities. So if you're interested in serving in a ministry here in FICF, uh, we have different ministries that you can actually be part of. So if you want to serve God more in a different way, please reach out to Sister Rada Ongel. Do you want a special number or give your testimony? Please contact Sister Jillian Lopez or Sister Rhoda and please let us know in advance so that we can schedule you for a special number or a testimony. <laughs> Next, every last Sunday of the month, we celebrate the birthdays, the anniversaries of the family member here in FICF. So we encourage everyone to bring a food like the Filipino tradition. We bring potluck of dish of every any kind that you want and we celebrate this every last Sunday of the month. So it's a potluck, so whoever is interested to bring food, uh, please coordinate with Sister Virgie Amos. Lastly, after service, we're gonna be having a fundraising for the youth. If, if you wanna participate or support a youth, you are welcome to participate. You can buy uh, the merchandise or the food that they are selling after service. And if you actually want to sponsor a child for this camp, uh, please reach out to one of the staff there on the booth. Thank you. Once again, we're very glad that you were able to join us here today in our Sunday service. And we're hoping that God touch you in a way that you would never imagine. And let us prepare our hearts for praise and worship for the Lord. Thank you.